How many of you are sick of us going to the lake? Because we're not sick of it yet, so we're still going. Hi, welcome to our day. Another day of packing up the beach bag. I've got everything transferred over already. And I think I just have to get a swimsuit on. We have the pineapple bag today with food. We have two sandwiches for you, two sandwiches for Chelsea. I wanted five. You wanted five sandwiches? Yes. <laughs> for whatever reason, she loves to have peanut butter sandwiches at the lake. Yeah. So I make plenty of them. We got ice water, we've got their cinch bags all ready to go. And I just need to go get my swimsuit on and we'll pack up the car. Today is, what day is today? Thursday. Thursday. Purple, Purple shirt, shirt, black, black. shorts. Yeah. Same as the other day. She's gonna get all of her cheer stuff ready to go so that she can just come home from the lake, take a shower, and get ready to go to cheer, right? Yeah. And it's wonderful because she's starting to get tired at night. <laughs> I was tired. I've been telling her I'm not gonna start waking you up earlier and earlier to make you more and more tired for school time. I gotta get Kaylee to clean this area today. It's so gross. That is not clean. All right. One thing I got at Marshall's yesterday were more blades because I've been shaving my face at night, like when I wash my face and stuff, but I'm not seeing the fuzz on that side of my face. And you can see it in the mornings or in the car. And I'm gonna put one of these in my car, actually. If you don't have tweezers and a little razor in your car, you're not over 40. <laughs> and if you are over 40, put one of these in your car because Right now I know it's there, I'm just gonna shave it. Because once I know it's there, I hate knowing it's there, and that people can see it in the sunlight at the beach, or that like sunscreen will get glistening in it. I'm not putting on makeup, I haven't for a while. I've been enjoying it, so yes. Okay, let me see if you can, can you see that peach fuzz on there? That's disgusting. That's like literally from just a few swipes called peach fuzz. Okay, now we're gonna go load up the car. We have just a few weeks left of school. I mean school, summer. So I'm just trying to get it in whenever we can. So let's go. All right, in case you didn't know, I have one pair for the beach and one pair for <laughs> regular use. These ones stay nice and clean. These ones are my new ones for the year. So I have old ones that I take to the beach to get all nasty. Kayak, chairs, three of them, umbrella, did not forget. I'm actually bringing the table today and we got our food and my beach bag is up front. Yeah. You guys ready? Only a couple more weeks of this. Maybe even a couple more times. And then school starts. Don't talk about it. <laughs> Don't talk about Bruno. No, school. <laughs> I know. Eventually I'm not gonna have days like these. So I wasn't gonna film them doing this, but in five years, I won't have them coming to do it with me. So I'm gonna just remember it for now while we have it. And I don't really break too easily, but I'm worth it, cause I'll slip into your dreams tonight, oh. So Ashley just made sure she had a sandwich. We have three left for them. And then you're like, all right, so I'm gonna have this for lunch now. What is it, Ash? I did not pack this, by the way. I did. Yeah, you did. What is it? A donut. A donut. <laughs> From yesterday. Kidding. Can you open it? So, I guess if you did have a sandwich, you can have a donut. So give me, so give me your all. I'll take it, I'll take it to Mars, oh. I'll stick like glue inside your mind. Just watch me break it. Them. I like the name Bruce. Bruce the Goose. Bruce the Goose. That is a good way to go. He, I think he thinks people are his buddies. Yeah. He's pretty... We don't, we don't know where he came from, but he's been here like a couple of months. Yeah. He's usually over... They're over by the boat launch. You want to try and do it? <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> this is really cool. Yeah. He's quite... I definitely, Friendly, huh? I definitely think he's, think he's a pet. Yeah, I think he might have gotten out. Ah, oh, too scared. <laughs> well, too. Hi, Bruce the Goose. You want to go get a picture with him? Hi, buddy. Bruce, you want some bread? I don't know. 
Chelsea's going to the sandbar. No. The it. Bye, Goose. Oh, Bye, Bruce. Goose. He's going to go down and get now? some water. Alright, so Chelsea decided to take the kayak out. I forgot our life jackets, which usually they're just kind of puttering around here at the shore. And it's not that deep. Um, so they can just usually just stand right up. Um, my fault for not bringing the life jackets, but Ellie, and, um, Ellie, Ashley's friend that's here, her mom dropped her off with to be with us. Other moms aren't here quite yet, but Chelsea decided to take the kayak out to the sandbar without a life jacket. And now, I've been keeping an eye on her, and I was gonna send the other girls over here to come and check on her, but now, I see a boat and no Chelsea. And I can't quite tell if she's gotten to the sandbar. Doesn't seem like she's in the right spot for it. But she's not in the boat. It's at the shore, so I think she's at the sandbar. This is like all no-no. One, she's alone. Two, she's with no life jacket. Three, she didn't tell me. She's not in trouble, but kind of doing all the wrong things. She's wanting to be older, wanting to be a big kid, but she's got to learn that by doing so, you have to play by the rules. That's why the older kids get to do that, because they do play the, by the rules. So, let's go and find her. Kayak was in this area over here. Um, I don't see her here. She's right there. No! Go back! No, go back! All right, she's right there. And she's gonna paddle back over to the beach. Right there. The sandbar that the kids like to come to is like right up here. And I get it, this area over here is really, really nice. And the sand is better over here. It actually like feels good on the feet. I just didn't know she was coming over here. So you went on a little adventure out to the sandbar, yes? Next time, can you just wear a life jacket? No, I don't like wearing that. Jacket. Well, it's deep water, honey, if something happens. But you had fun? Yeah. It's a little bit of a workout coming back on the current, right? It's not really. The Is water, it okay? The water was like kind of pushing me towards here. So. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. I have some crabby kids. We were a little late coming home from the lake because Chelsea and, um, Ashley's friend took the kayak out and we couldn't get him to come back. So now we have 10 minutes to get Ashley ready for cheer. I think I'm pulled in enough. Gotta double check. <laughs> so she's a little stressed. She wanted an hour at home. Yeah, she wanted an hour at home before she had to go to cheer. Now we have 10 minutes. Sorry, you can't see me. So gotta get them ready to go. Okay, we've got a vitamin water, a banana, I've got a fruit pouch in the car. I'll get your bag, Ash. She just needs socks, yeah. right? And she's taking a water bottle, because it's still hot out there. And a spray bottle. But yeah, water bottle and a spray bottle, I meant. Yes. And then you can spray yourself with it. Down. What? My hair is too tight. Oh, is it too tight? tight? I'm down. sorry. It's fine, okay. <laughs> okay, put that in there. Jeez. We'll fix it. All right, we did it. This is exactly 5.15. What do you need? My water bottle. Oh, it's in the back of the, right here. And we have seven minutes, Ash, and we're at the park already. That's insane. We're like so early. How did you do that? Yeah, people are coming, but we're early for sure. 
So, good job getting ready, kiddo. I tried to sneak in. I'm literally in the trees. Like, I'm like, <laughs> tried to sneak up. And the second I got here, Ashley like waved her palm at me. <laughs> she saw me. Oh, gotta, let me do it. Let me show you more. She's so stinking cute. Right there. I'll leave her alone. It's just so cute to watch them. I always come back a little early so I can watch. I can't help it. I want to record everything for you guys because it's so stinking cute. They're so cute. I didn't go home. I went and got some dinner and just sat on the side of the road over in the shade. Not here at the park, just five minutes away from here. It was like, I'm just like wasting gas to just go back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. When I'm probably likely to either sit and edit at home or um, watch on my phone. And I'm tired, so I probably would have just sat and did the exact same thing I did here at the park. Make sure there's no one sitting in their car next to me. I'm just tired. But I have an idea. I've got to run it past Jason because I have an idea that I want to try and do and something I need to buy to make me more productive when I'm editing because I always kind of feel guilty just sitting there editing for hours and hours and hours and not being physically active, physically productive. But then I get done with that and I'm tired or I have to run errands or... So I'm actually going to call Jason right now. He's <laughs> ironically still trying to do our taxes. Yes, from last year. Um, our accountant is still waiting on closing out our taxes. We always file for an extension. But um, he can't get one um, thing to close on his accounting books. And so he can't, if he can't close it, he can't run the final reports to send to our accountant. And she can't file our taxes. We've already paid the taxes. <laughs> That's the ironic thing. We've already paid our taxes. She already basically knows the rough estimate of what we owe and but she can't like officially like turn them in for us and she wants to go on vacation with her husband <laughs> she's like can you you have until like tomorrow to get this done because I don't want to do taxes anymore I want to go on vacation with my husband my daughters are going off to school I want to be done and have like two or three weeks off and not do anything so he's stuck at work but I wanted to ask him a quick question. And depending on what he says, I'll tell you what it is. If not, and I'll tell you anyway and he tell you that he said no. So let's find out. Okay, you saw me in the trees, huh? Yeah, you were not. I was no, I wasn't trying to be like sneaky. I just suddenly saw that you were right there. You're so cute. Yes. All right, I want to, we, Kaylee says that Max doesn't like when you hug. Jacob? Yeah. Totally yeah. fine right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, protective. Come on, give him a pat, give him a pat. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> Max, it's been like Come a on, year and a half. Okay. He's very worried. Come here. <laughs> Max. Goodness sake. Yeah, she's, he's a Karen. <laughs> Bye, Jacob. Goodness sake. Now he's upset that Kaylee's leaving. He's going to mope right here. Oh. Good thing Matthew's right. Are you going to sit here and mope? Yeah, he doesn't even want his owner. You're gonna sit here and wait for her, huh? Oh, no. Nope, he's. Nope. <laughs> what one do you choose, Max? No, if you leave, he will whimper like crazy. Like, yeah, he's gonna sit in here and whimper. Oh, look at that little glisten. It's not even that hot in here. 
just have a very red face. I did get sunburned. I always get sunburned at the end. Oh, and your cheeks. Look at your cheeks. They look really bad on camera, but they're not terrible. And then she had a little spot on her shoulders. It literally, we can get burned right at the very end when we're packing it all up. The umbrella comes down, we're standing in the sun. Walking and that really, back. walking back, rinsing everything off, getting into the car. You literally like burned. 20 minutes that it takes us, 20, 30 minutes that we do that. The oh, sunscreen is worn off. And but when you want to tan, you can't. I know. <laughs> we don't have tanning bodies. Chelsea does. Chelsea does. Chelsea yes. did get a little bit of cheeks. Because she was out on that kayak quite a bit and she forgot to come back and put sunscreen on. We're going to end our night. I'm, I remembered as I'm editing today's video that I told you I was going to ask Jason if we can get something. And it will go here in my office um, if I end up getting it. We will, Jason and I are going to discuss it more tomorrow and look at some buying options. I can get it really quick if he, I don't need his permission to get it. It's just if it's a good choice to get it um, for both of us, but it's mainly for me. And it's fine if it's just for me, but he wants to kind of look at like, is this the one, is this the right one to get? My battery is flashing. Also, we kind of have a fun announcement tomorrow. I'm looking at something on my computer screen and there's kind of something fun that might happen tomorrow. So stay tuned. I don't think it's gonna happen today. So stay tuned if you wanna know what that is. It's really exciting. It's gonna happen tomorrow, I think. Which will be fun, because Jason's home. So, stay tuned. Maybe some fun things happening tomorrow. Bye. Take care. Of all the magic places in the world I've been to, this is where my heart is. Oh, you know it's true. No matter where I go, I'm coming home to you.